Anglo Gold Ashanti is set to buy into Canadian gold and uranium producer First Uranium for $30 million. On the line to tell us more about this acquisition is company CEO Mark Kutifani. Thanks so much, Mark, for joining us today. Well, as I said, Anglo Gold Ashanti announcing that it's going to be acquiring just on 20% a stake in First Uranium. And, you know, traders I've been speaking to today saying that's entirely unexpected. What on earth is Anglo Gold Ashanti doing this for? So run us through some of the rationale. Well, firstly, uh, a lot of people don't realize, but we are the largest uranium producer in South Africa, and it's been a very important and significant contributor to our business. And we've made lots of improvements in the last couple of years. We've created lots of value. And uh, for us, uh, we do have an interest in uranium. It was opportunistic. We saw this stake had come up for sale. They're producing both uranium or looking to produce both uranium and gold. And for us, we saw that it was a potential uh, fit, but uh, at the moment it's an investment. And uh, f possibly misleading as well is that name First Uranium, because just as much as you're involved in the uranium space, we've got a First Uranium just as involved in the gold sector. So run us through that and the kind of synergies uh, you're looking to extrapolate here. Well, don't forget, uh, you know, this is a, a step that we've taken uh, as an investment. Uh, where the connections might occur. We've still to think through and look at. Uh, they are looking at producing both gold and uranium and there are certainly fits there. And for us, uh, uh, it's a starting point for review and conversation. But uh, I must remind you as well that the competition group hasn't uh, approved this yet, so we've still got some hurdles to go through. But from our point of view, it's a very interesting opportunity that uh, we'll have a look at and decide where we go from here. So it's very much an investment, as you say, at this stage of the game. The company has added, though, that it would acquire additional uh, stakes in First Uranium shares. Uh, you know, is that looking more likely than not, or will you have to go through this evaluation process pretty extensively first? Oh, no, I wouldn't speculate on where we'll go from here. As I said, it was opportunistic. Uh, the stake was up for sale. Uh, we're the largest uranium producer in the country. We've added lots of value for our shareholders in that space. And so uh, we thought that it was appropriate for us to take up the opportunity and we'll have a good look and decide where we go from there. When you say, uh, you know, at this stage we're looking at it just being for investment purposes, I mean, just how much value is this bringing to your stable, you know, in this current status? Well, at the moment uh, we thought that the price was reasonable. Um, and therefore we took the position how much potential we could see will be determined by the work we do over the next uh, period of time. Just how involved are you going to be though in the production side of things on that end? How involved are you going to be in that first uranium business? Oh, at this stage it's an investment. Uh, we don't anticipate doing anything more than take, a, take an interest in the business as an investment and uh, we'll make our decisions upon uh, the judgments we make uh, over the next while. Some of the assets there that you've got a particular eye on because we know that for one is a winnie uh, and production there is being ramped up and that's certainly got in the eye of uh, many investors. Oh, now we're happy with the position we've taken in first uranium so we'll just keep our mind focused on that for the moment.